I know a lot of people usually start this kind of video by talking about how they used to watch these college decision reaction videos religiously and although it is true for me as well um, I won't bore you guys with all the details of how I first came across these college decision reaction videos when I was a sophomore and how I also used to watch these religiously and now I'm super excited to be making my Haley. To give some context, I'm an international student and I currently live in China and I do the IB diploma program. And in this video, I'll be reacting to seven... I'll be reacting to seven universities, some of which I applied early to, like ED and EA. And I'll just put the universities on here. I applied to the US, UK, and Hong Kong. So you'll see reactions to universities in all three places. I hope you guys enjoy. Hi, today is the 18th of November. I just woke up and I got an email from Pitt and I got accepted. <laughs> um, I got accepted to their Swanson School of Engineering. Dear Manny, congratulations, you have been admitted to the University of Pittsburgh. Oh, there's another email. Dear Manny, congratulations on your admission, blah blah blah. Due to your exceptional academic performance, we are able to extend an additional admission offer, that of guaranteed admission to the MS graduate engineering program of your choice at the University of Pittsburgh. <laughs> I know it's a, it's a safety, but like, my first acceptance, yay! <laughs> Hi, so today is December 18th. I'm gonna open my brown ED decision. And I, I am so nervous, but I'm telling myself, it was a 16% acceptance rate. If I get rejected, that does not change anything about me, does not change my achievements, who I am, my self-worth at all, and an acceptance doesn't validate that at all. So. I'm just telling myself, it's okay, it's okay, because I know I'm gonna be rejected, and I'll be fine. <sighs> okay, okay. Log in. <sighs> I'm so nervous. Uh, <laughs> status update. Rejection does not change anything. It does not change anything. And if they don't want me, it's their loss. Okay. Be admission decision. Three, two, one. Deferred. Oh my god, it wasn't a rejection. My heart is beating so fast right now. Deferred. I think. Yep. Okay, that's that's fine. It's just more waiting. But at least I wasn't rejected. <gasps> okay, see you guys. Today is the 23rd of December. Just to prove that I don't actually film all my videos on my couch. I just kind of deliberately came to film this part of the video in this like cafe and restaurant place with my friend Kevin. We traveled an hour just to yeah. get here. <laughs> Go check out his YouTube channel. I'll link it down below. But yeah, today we're checking Case Western. If I'm gonna be honest, I don't really care whether I get in or not. So I'm just gonna check it to get it over with. Okay, so I'm gonna log in. I'm nervous. <laughs> New update. Okay, I got deferred. I'm honestly, I'm not surprised because I didn't even do an interview. So you know what, it's fine. Where does it say you? Oh, uh, there. Yeah. Decide to defer a decision on your application. And so I'll get my RD decision on March 20th. Hi, so today's January 8th and I just got an email from UCAS and King's College of London. So I'm guessing it's an update from them. And yeah, so I'm just gonna log in. Okay, you have received decisions from one out of five choices. Okay. <laughs> uh, King's 
College London, University of London has offered you a place for electronic engineering. <laughs> Yay! Okay, I'm just so I'm 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 really happy right now. <laughs> so it's my first UK university acceptance. I'm just glad because after two deferrals, that feels really nice. King's College London. So the university or, or college has offered you a place subject to conditions. So it's a conditional offer. I'm just so happy I got in. <laughs> Hi, so today is the 28th of January. I just came back home from school and today was very nerve-wracking because I got an email from Northeastern during class that my admissions position is out. So I decided to wait until I got home to check. Honestly, I'm not expecting much because first of all, they're not my top school. Second of all, I applied mainly because they didn't have a supplemental essay and third of all, they also practice yield protection. Not saying that if I don't get in, I'm yield protected, but just that um, I'm not expecting much. I'm just going to log in. <laughs> well, that was fast. Okay. <laughs> Deferred. Yep, that's what I expected. But, wow. So I got deferred from three schools. That's fun. That means I'm gonna have like, what? A lot of decisions in regular decision. That'll be fun. Hi, so today is February the 3rd. I got an email while I was in class that said there's an update to my application to Hong Kong UST. I applied to Hong Kong because that's where I'm from. All right, log in. Well, that was fast. I got two offers. Yay. <laughs> really exciting update. I just clicked on um, the link to either accept or decline the offer. And then I just saw this. <laughs> I got a scholarship as well. I'm probably going to look back on this video and be like, why do I look so weird? And why am I acting so weird? I'm sorry if I am. Dear Miss Chu, congratulations. We are pleased to offer you admissions to full-time undergraduate studies at the Hong Kong University of Science and Technology together with the University Admission Scholarship. <laughs> they only want 34 points? I kind of want to check- oh, okay, here's the scholarship. Okay, so if I get 45, which is um, not very possible, if I get a full tuition scholarship. If I get um, 42 to 44, I get um, full tuition per academic year. No one has given me that much money before. <laughs> That's so nice. Hi again. To be honest, I really thought I would be ending the video after the HKUST reaction, but it turns out um, HKU sent me three emails um, today telling me that there has been updates to my application. By the way, today is the 5th of February, so it's literally been two days since I received my um, UST decision. I think I applied to like Four programs? I have no idea why. So let's just check. Application status. Yay! <laughs> I, you know, my eyesight sucks, so I couldn't even read what it says. I just saw the green boxes and I was like, <laughs> and yep, they still haven't given me an offer for um, economics, which. To be honest, I'm not expecting an offer, so I kind of want to withdraw just so I don't get a rejection. So yeah, I got offers for Bachelor of Engineering, Bachelor of Engineering in Engineering Science, and the Global Engineering and Business Program. I just found out that for um, the Global Engineering and Business Program, um, <laughs> apparently they only have 14 places for f first year students. <laughs> I'm shook <laughs> because for for the Bachelor of Engineering program they have places for like 383 so that's insane <laughs> and and also my dad went to HKU and HKUST so that's really cool. Mm. Are you proud of me? <laughs> As a summary, I got four acceptances and three deferrals, which was way beyond my expectations. 
I was so surprised I didn't get a single rejection. Really looking forward for many of those to come in regular decision. <laughs> so part two of my college decision reactions will be coming out in April, which will feature my reactions to my RD schools. If you like this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up and leave a comment about anything, whether it be college app questions, video requests, or even like say hi to my mom or dad because it took a lot of convincing to get them on camera. Please do subscribe. I'd really appreciate it if you did. And yeah, thanks for watching. Stick around for part two and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. <laughs>